just depends on what spells he decides to randomly choose. Whether or not you get annihilated. That works. Is he running? Take that, and that. And we'll give those to her. I can't. We'll just loot all the arrows then. Okay, we won't. Take these, take these. Fine leather helmets are pretty sweet. Alright, but he's full up. Take that. Shouldn't there be four stacks of arrows? I found three so far. Though I guess it will have to do. Just small empire encampment. There isn't much here beyond what you found on their bodies. Supply lines must have been cut. The only thing of interest to you is a quiver of bolts left unused because none of them had a crossbow. Take it. Blessed bolts. That takes care of that problem. Now the only thing are the spiders, and I'm not ready for the spiders. Hey. <coughs> Excuse me. Try to open the door. Uh, no, the rune key does not have the password. I remember that door was locked, but I didn't remember it wanted a vocal password. I thought it just needed a key. I forget what that was. Oh, right, that's just where I found a bar of iron, and that's it. That was the Slith Fortress, such as it was. I 
don't like fighting so many mages at once, even if they aren't summoning aid, because... You know, the spam of slow is just as much of a death sentence as anything else. I'm almost certain that these jerks are... the way into the, uh, spider caves. But unless I have level three haste, that's not gonna do me any good. turns because we got slowed once. Just nail me for 54 damage with a melee attack. There's no way. I could struggle past the demon, but I can't struggle past that. I am out of experience in this area. As far as I can tell, there's nothing left aside from the spider caves, which I can't get to because... It's guarded a little too hard. Central compound or a large farm. Pins and animals are to the east. Farmhouse is to the west. And a tunnel leads to a cave wall to the northeast. Most of Avernum's food comes from small farms like these. A variety of mushrooms, lizard meat, and cave cow milk provide the bulk of the Avernite diet. The wall is a very heavy wall. The residents are all armed. This must be a dangerous area. Apparently there's a healer here too, or so I heard. Jasmine. Radiant redhead woman, maybe in her early twenties, is running various farm errands. She has many small scars on her hands and arms, which show up well against a translucent white skin. Welcome, my name is Jasmine. What you doing? Nicholas and I work uh, for Tor and Carol. It's their farm. I watch the livestock. He works the mushrooms. Livestock doesn't seem friendly. She has the scars on her hands. It's sad work. The cows are always sickly and sad. And they're better than those lizards. Those nasty cretins will take your hand off if you let them. But where else can we get the meat? What do you think of this farm? It's the biggest homestead around here. Tor and Carol look after the other farms, organize, that sort of thing. Nicholas and I just work for them. They're good to work for. Uh, they've uh, just been under a lot of strain because of the salamanders. What salamanders? They're down in the larder, and they're dangerous. We can't get them out. You should talk to Tor about it. Okay. Tor. A dour, well-worn man sits at the end of the table, pondering. A heavy blade hangs at his side. He nods to you. My name's Tor. Welcome to the Gunston Homestead. This your homestead? Aye, it is. Looks like something's making him uncomfortable. Something bothering you? Sorry, it's just no offense. But I've fought Nephilim for too long to be able to accept humans traveling with them. I don't care for their kind at all. Okay. What fort did you work at? I used to work at Fort Avernum. I gave weapons and stuff to the new arrivals. Everyone who arrived from the surface w world went by me. I gave them a knife and food and directions. Without my stuff, nobody would have lived long. Of course, the Empire stopped sending people down, Fort Avernum shut down, and I left the army. Oh well, what can you do? 
What's Fort Avernum now? Nothing. Rubble. Abandoned. I can't say that it makes me sad. Nobody knew we'll be trapped down here. Something else I'd like to... Okay. Who's your lady? Carol. She's a healer in these parts. Okay. How do you help the other farmers? You see, I was a soldier. I had the know-how. So I was a natural to help the farmers organize and stuff when the Nephilim attack started. Haven't done it much lately, though. Because of uh, those darn salamanders. What is your salamander problem? Shakes his head. Not long ago, a mated pair of salamanders broke in here. We tried to drive them out, but they hid in our larder, and we can't get them out. They're eating our stores. Kill them, and I'll reward you best I can. What are the Nephilim up to? They haven't given us a moment's peace since they built that fort to the north. Can't stand the Nephil jerks. He stares pointedly at the Nephil in your group. No offense. Yeah, right. Man, I hate your guts. You're filthy and horrible, and I want you to die. No offense. Scrolls covered with arcane symbols. Oddly, they're not magical, however. One word keeps coming up when you read them. Algebra. Ugh. The most dreaded tome of all. Larder. Larder. Oh, that's probably the cave. As it slopes down to the east, the air is stuffy and dank. You can definitely smell sulfur. It's unnaturally warm. You think you can hear hissing. Boy, howdy. That was hard. Ta-da! Thanks for teleporting us in here. Yeah, just wait, wait for it to dissipate. Go on, get. Okay, that fire is very persistent. And I'll. Oh. I'll take all the food. Because I need it for stuff, like surviving a long, treacherous river journey. Hey. Took care of those salamanders that have been bothering you. Thanks thanks for your help. I got something for you. We in the Gunston house remember those that help us. He disappears in the next room and returns with a delicate necklace for you. This will turn many a blow away. Can I buy some provisions? Ooh, dried meat. Of course, just because, uh... Carol. You're a tall, striking woman with shark dark hair. She grinds something up in a mortar and pestle as she talks. I'm Carol, of the Hammer... Hammer Clan? Welcome to our humble household. I looked at some of your books. Do you know anything about this algebra stuff? Oh, it's a new thing. It's called mathematics. Recently become an interest of mine. Great fun, really. It takes a few years to truly master. Someone of Vernum has to think of these things. Creepy. Uh, what you doing? I and my husband look after the farm and the farms around here. We raise livestock and some mushrooms. I'm also a healer. I can help you if you like. Sure, heal me. She's a cheap healer. That's good to know. But I can heal up if I really need to just by resting with the food I stole from them. Nope. Let's fill in the gap there. That's right, get out of my way. Somebody leveled up, so let's, uh... Is it in here? No. Was there a trainer in this town? Yeah, here he was. Rose. Henrietta leveled up, not Rose. Bose at level 10. Let's go ahead and increase dexterity. Jara needs gets even more points. Mage spells. Uh, 
Uh, rune reading 11, rune reading 10. He's almost to level, uh, Suresh is almost to level 8. And we're well liked now. That's good. I'm gonna pause it real quick and see how long I've been going. So, one second. Alright, as you can see, we still got, uh, 30, 25 minutes. And since I don't think I can fight those spiders without dying horrendously, it's probably time to head downriver. Pretty sure I'm going to sell some stuff first, but... Sell some stuff, buy some stuff. Don't have anything that needs... Oh, I do have something that needs identifying. This. Shielding charm. Are you serious? He's already... <sighs> Give me a break. There, now he's got double shielding. Shield ring and shielding charm. Long sword, sell these blessed bolts in this nice fur and that nice fur. Sell those fine leather armors. And that iron armor. And that silver necklace, and that fine leather armor. Pass these arrows over to Henrietta. How many does she have now? 28. Man, exorbitant prices. I could go broke just buying pieces from this jerk. You sell mage spells, we don't need that right now. Well, I'm going to need some energy potions, I'm sure. Didn't really mean to give those to him, though. They both have two. He's got four healing potions and a curing potion. She's got healing potion. Should be fine. And we still have over a thousand gold. <coughs> Nothing in there I need. Can't 